is 707 Bros time with a new video. Um, this time we're gonna draw a chest pin. Um, so let's get started. And first, chest pin. Is, his head is basically just a circle. I'm using a reference I got online. Um, I think I'm doing bigger. Um, Alright, so I'm gonna do it around over here. Because he's gonna be facing this way with his tail coming out around here. So. Do them closer to one side. Alright, so. Just try to make a. Not a perfect circle, because I don't think anybody can make a perfect circle. They can, but you know what I mean. Alright, so there we got our, our reference line for the head. Now, let's start. So, Alright, so we're going to start with the head. So around let's see close to the middle and then I think like around here we're gonna do just kind of like a circle um let's see I don't know if I should make it further down I think I'll make it further up because this is gonna be his face on this side so um, started from here, and then let's end it around here. So it's basically like a football shape on this side, and then it's like kind of like a moon, a slice on the other side. So just basically try to get this right here, um, close to halfway, not necessarily halfway. You can make a line like in the middle just so you can know should have done that in the beginning but it's all right all right now that we got this line we're gonna start um adding some of the details for example he has like a a brown spot around here around there all right um Let's see, we're going to do, um, let's do his eye. So it's close to the middle. And it's around half the size of this. So just do a circle. Like that. Just do an oval. And then we're going to do the eyebrow. And it curves up right here like that you can do the nose which is with which is just like a straight line and then this one goes up and it's just like a weird triangle and then this one just meets up with the corner right here like that and it's um did it kind of too big it should be smaller or close to the same size as the eye just clean this up a little bit so it goes in straight line like that this one goes out a little bit and then just meet up with this one like this yep um there we go then we're gonna do the mouth which is around here and it just curves close like if it curves like it'll meet up with the eye like that so it's basically a circle but we're gonna erase this just an example like that that wasn't necessary but you know what i mean all right so now we got the face going he also has another point triangle that goes that ends like around here so just go like that and it helps to look at the point where it ends instead of just going like this instead of starting from the bottom try uh, looking at the point like I did on um, with this right now like I'm doing now or how I did it with the points on the head it just makes it easier and then like for example in the picture I'm using it's not gonna be perfect you know what I mean but there's this gap right here so just try to make that gap 
and it's basically like that so we could also do on the eye let me just do this here because we can clean this up at the end but um just so you, he has more character um, we're gonna do the the shine on his eye that way you guys could get a better um look or idea how he's gonna be in the end up looking all right so then around here he has some like spikes coming out I guess these are like right in the center in the back of his head so just do a couple lines and um, yeah so they're basically they look kind of like feathers spikes or leaves that's why they they look to me um so now we're gonna do the bigger ones that he has on the side of his head and all right so they're basically spaced out the same um length of the eye so just try to make them spaced out the same length and then the i guess the, it's uh his ear so basically the ear is around the same um length a little bit longer than his head than the shape of his head so we're just gonna do a straight line like that so just try to make this line all close to the same length as the head it is a little bit bigger so we are gonna do a little bit bigger but it's just an example so like that all right so that's one and then the other one shows up on the other side of the head so just don't make it um further than this one so like this so now we got the ears done now we're gonna do this right here um so there's the middle one's the biggest one so like I said, don't do it, like, um, look for the other sides and then just meet up in the end. And this one is bigger than these by a lot, so, like that. Now, look at the point on the picture that you're looking at, or if you guys are looking at the same one as me. Um, just try to make it the same length as this one. Same thickness and everything, although this one does kind of come out from behind this one so like that all right so this one does go all the way in um all right so then he has like this spot on the back of his head so just do like half a circle like that and then we're gonna start doing the body so we're gonna do this straight line like this um, probably like half the size of this so around there and then we're gonna do another line like this just try to make it the same length close to the same length um, now we're gonna do the other body I mean the other side of the body so it should be around three two to three times the length of this on this side and just do a straight line don't go further than this um go little by little don't don't um do other lines that don't go ahead uh two ahead and while doing one side try to do them evenly and then just meet up at the end it just makes it more easier sorry all right so now we're gonna do his hand which are pretty big all right so They do go over his body, so like this. All right, so it just kind of makes a point in the body. So like that, we're gonna do another one over here. So start it around here, and it's just basically the same, the same shape. So this one goes around here. 
like that. It does have these, uh, kind of like these here. He has two of them. So they start around here. Um, yeah, so. Like that. The other one around here. Mm, this one's not that big because it's uh, further behind his head. Alright, like that. Now we're going to do um, split his um, fingers. You can call them fingers. So he just has two, two lines that define his hands like that. I'm going to do two more over here. Like that. We could erase this line now that we know. Well, now that we have this one right here, that was just to help us know that we're gonna place the, the that the line is gonna be where it's supposed to be. All right. So now what we could do is the foot. So it does make like a circle, like this. Let's just make a perfect a circle. This is just to help us. Um. Yeah. So don't do it too big. Um, roughly so it could fit in the head like on the face area just roughly that big um, It's not gonna be a full circle. That's just to so it could help us out while we do the rest of the leg. So now we're gonna do um, Small gap here and then get as further you go um, Get a little bit further than the other line like this meet up with this one like that so you can see it's closer here than over here. Alright. Like that. And now around in the middle, we're going to do just a line. Or maybe just you could do a straight line. Using this reference line over here. Just do a small line. It's going to be his foot. So let's go around here. Just meet up over here with this one like that. Like that. And then around halfway, not halfway, around 60% the distance here. We're just gonna do this um curved line right here. And this is his um claws. Um, we could fi we could fix that later on once we um uh, finish the drawing. For now, let's just do a line, and then close to around here, we're gonna do the tail. So the tail just curves up to around here, and then just try to meet up with this line over here. And then remember, try to make the gap the same. Um, the closer you get to the point, the smaller the gap should be. So like that. Now we're going to do the other leg. So just draw a straight line down. Like this. Um, not all the way, not lower than this one. And then just curve this one up. Like that. And then just draw a line around here so like that now we could raise this line and we could raise this one and part of that one erase all this all right I'm just redo this one all right, so like that so we're basically done with most of the shape on um, wait up he does have like a line around um, I say around here so just curve it up a little bit more than you would normally do um, let's make this a little bit more pointy um, now we could just we're basically done we got um, just looking at the reference right now we got 
everything done. Yeah, so now you guys could just clean it up and just look at it. Um, yeah, I think it's alright. Now we could just um, clean it up. And what I mean by clean it up is uh, erase the lines that shouldn't be there. For example, these were right here. This one right here, I mean, um, doesn't go there. Here. Um, here. Um, yeah, so just basically these lines. That it doesn't come out there. Doesn't meet up all the way. Um, Alright, just clean this one up. Clean these up. Don't erase it completely. That way you guys can still see the line that you guys did. And just clean it up a little bit. Like that. Clean up the lines like this. For example, this leg. I mean, the foot. I'm gonna do a little bit better. Like that. And this is what I mean by cleaning it up. Um, fix these lines. They're not completely straight. like this it's just little things that will make the picture look better than normal you know what I mean so all right so it just make this a little bit thinner like this see these are like the little things now you can um, look at the picture you see something off now's the time you can change it now that you have the whole picture done um, because the picture, once you're done, it does um, um, give you um, a better um, uh, look and feel. So now you guys can see what it changed. Now's the best time since you can see the, the picture a little bit at once. You know what I mean? The finished product. Alright, so just fix this line like this. Like, for example, right here, you really can't even tell what it is. Don't erase it completely. Alright, so. Like this. Like that. That. See, it, looks, it just makes it look way better. I'm um, cleaning up all the lines, making it a little bit darker now. All right, so let me erase this line. This one. So, yeah, so, let me just do this line because it does come out a little bit further. Um, so, yeah, we're basically done with um, chest pin. Um, yeah. Now you guys could just finish doing it. Um. I think I'm just gonna end up um, doing it in pencil since I like uh, I'm more of a shading person, black and gray. I'm not that good at coloring, as you guys could tell in my other videos. I enjoy uh, more uh, doing it in pencil. So from here on, you guys could you guys could go color it you guys could leave it like this you guys could basically do anything from here from here on you guys could color it crayon anything that you guys have a bell level for you guys so yeah so i just want to say uh, thanks for watching um and i'll see you guys next time next i think i'm gonna uh, do fennekin and then we'll do froakie 
so um yeah so thanks for watching 707 rose sound and hope i help you guys out later all right hello everyone um i didn't last time i didn't really check this part out um i did this too far away from how the picture looks so we're gonna do it closer get it a little bit more accurate um, I wasn't really paying attention at this time. Alright, so this one does get close to this one. So it's just a matter of erasing. It's not nothing big or really noticeable, but I just thought that I might add it in. Um, yeah, so it's just basically the same, the same thing, but a little bit bigger and a little... A little bit further up. Alright, so like this. Clean that up a little bit. Like this. And this one over here. Like that. Like I said, you guys could always clean that up. And just finish it up over here. So I don't know if it makes like a big difference for you guys. But I just wanted to get it um, a little bit more accurate. Um, to the reference that I'm using. So um, yeah if you guys could change it if you guys want. You guys don't have to. But if you do then it's all good. And um, yeah so uh, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Alright hello you guys. Um, I did decide to... To color it, didn't turn out too good. Like I said, I'm just using color pencils. I'm not the best at drawing, at coloring. But um, hope you guys like it. And um, yeah. So thanks for watching. I wanna be the very best, like no one ever was. To catch them is my real test. To train them is my. Call.